One of the best things about the Fujifilm cameras are that you have access to their Fujifilm recipes. Now what these are are basically simulations that you can apply to your photos to get different effects. I would compare these to say like presets for your photos or LUTs for your videos. Now with so many out there, how can you choose which ones you want? Hey, what's going on everyone? Hope you're doing all right. My name is Matt, this is Dwyer Creatives, and today I wanna go over how you can kind of preview these Fujifilm recipes before you actually go out there. Now to do this, you're gonna need two things. Well, I guess technically three. One, you're gonna need a Fujifilm camera and I'm gonna be using the Fujifilm X106. Two, you're gonna need a computer with Fuji X Raw Studio in it. And three, you're gonna need a raw photo that you took on your Fujifilm camera. Now it is two minute Tuesday, so let's put two minutes on that clock and get this started. Maybe I can stick to that two minute. So the first thing we're gonna do is go into our menu and we're gonna go all the way down to this little double-sided line. So network USB settings and we're going to go to this connection mode. I have mine set for a USB card, but we're gonna be switching it over to USB raw conversion backup restore. I'm gonna go ahead and click that and back out to this. Now, next what you wanna do is go ahead and connect it to your computer and then make sure that you leave your camera on. Your camera is on and it is connected to your computer and you have Fujifilm X-Raw Studio open. You wanna make sure that you pick a photo that you have the raw file. It does not work with the JPEG, so you do need that raw file. And what we're gonna do is come over here to the top right to the profile. You'll see that I have a few of the recipes already up here, and these are just the ones I'm currently using, but you can go ahead and change any of these if you wanna try out or make your own custom ones. So when I talk about being able to preview a photo and what it would look like with a certain Fujifilm recipe on it, this is what I mean. So let's go ahead and click Reggie's Portra. So this is what it looks like with Reggie's Portra. I have Cuban Ace, Classic Cuban Negative, Classic Street Negative, Cuban Street Negative, Vibrant Arizona, Kodak Tri-X 400, and Pacific Blues. Now, all of these ones that I'm using as an example, you can find in Fuji X Weekly. I may have tweaked them a little bit with the clarity just to speed up that processing. For the most part, I've left all of these alone and maybe I'll go ahead and tweak them. But this is where you can go ahead, select the profile, and then you can go ahead and change the settings to maybe dial it in a little bit more. And this will just allow you to preview the Fuji recipes that you're thinking about using before you actually get out there if you really want to have one that you really want to use. So there you go. That is a really simple process just to get that preview to maybe help you dial in a specific Fujifilm recipe that is truly yours and your style. If you have any questions or comments about this process, let me know down in the comments section below. And as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.